a full-term neonate presents with bilious emesis. He has had decreased oral intake and had normal newborn course, including passage of meconium. He is afebrile, normotensive, mildly tachycardic, and tachyp. On physical exam, there are signs of dehydration. Initial x-rays reveal no free underneath the diaphragm. What is the next best step in management? A, lower contrast enema, B, pyloric ultrasound, C, upper GI series, or D, CT scan of the abdomen. So you know that the emesis is going to come from the second part of the duodenum and down. And so a pyloric ultrasound is just going to be at the pylorus, at the gastric outlet. So you want to get an upper GI series, which is going to be the contrast going all the way down and you getting serial x-rays to see where is going to be the obstruction. So bilious emesis, always think about small bowel obstruction. Other things for us to note is that the fact that he passed meconium is a pertinent negative to Hirschsprung, anal atresia, as well as meconium ileus. So let's go through this high guru test taking tip. Pediatric surgery questions frequently test bilious emesis. This is usually going to be an obstruction of the duodenum or lower down, like jejunum ilium. Assess this by obtaining a abdominal x-ray as well as an upper GI series to see where exactly the pathology is.